Where are we? I thought we'd lost the characteristic existence in Beyond. Ariana, is it true that we have come back to life in Beyond? To be honest, Cecile, I would say yes. We have indeed returned to characteristic life as girls from the Cheer Girls, aka the Destiny Girls. Oh yeah, I can remember that. It was that user, Azure Midnight Gemstone Dude 2K3. First they kicked us along with the Cheer Girls out of Beyond World, and then we don't know what happened to him after he's just gone. OMG! I do remember that. We used to go to Winter Academy Reformatory School in City for Troublemakers, or War 6 School, along with the Rainbow Maples, Tracy's crew, Hector's crew, and the male troublemaking group, the Outlaw Boys. And we also teamed up with the Outlaw Boys to get close to falling in love with them but failed. Speaking of them, aren't they still in jail? Um, I don't know if they're still in jail. However, can we still know their names, Larry Brooks, Jason Vasquez, and Aaron Morris? We really do hope that they're still around in Beyond City. Exactly. We might can't mention the rest of the Outlaw Boys members' names. Cecile, how long were we out for too long? I don't know Ariana. But it feels like we need to save them once again, so before we do so, we need a backup. We're going to need somebody who is an evil troublemaker like everyone else. Huh. Is that a person in a red car who wants to talk to us? If so, maybe we should go and see what they want. You know Ariana, I think it will be the best idea to go and ask them what they want us for. Let's talk to them in a red car so they won't get too impatient for us to show up. Hello? Uh, who are you? Hola chicas. My name is Estefania Martina Garcia. I'm a white Latina troublemaker, and this is my boyfriend, Freddy Jordan Ortega. I met him in college during the spring semester of 2024, and we started dating for several months. And this girl in the back seat is Jasmine Sisko Niminen, and she's from Finland. Hey, hey there! there. Why, hi there you three. My name is Cecile Bernard. And I'm Ariana Martinez. We're both from the disbanded girl group, the Destiny Girls, aka the Cheer Girls, created by Cute Princess Precure Fan 9000. And formerly owned by Azure Midnight Gemstone Dude 2K3. Wait. What? Cute Princess Precure Fan 9000 and Azure Midnight Gemstone Dude 2K3? We have never heard of those two users before. What happened to both of you? Well, it's kind of a long story, but back in 2019 to 2020, Ariana and I joined a girl named Penelope Taylor and other girls like Victoria, Melody, Maria, and Crystal to form our own group called the Cheer Girls, for we can say the sweet girls, and we became the most popular OC characters in Go Animate slash Beyond World in 2021. However, when 2022 arrived, many people started to hate us for being Mary Sue and treating us like troublemakers in Go Animate slash Beyond World. They renamed our group, the Destiny Girls. At the end of 2023, people started to treat us like we were dead topic characters, and they had us executed and kept us dead for a long time. Oh dear. That's terrible. This is why Estefania and I may never get to see you in person, because we went to your cemetery, where both of you are buried at. But luckily, we used Vine Logic to summon the Dragon Balls to bring you girls back to life, because we needed you to be part of our gang. Yeah, we know that. By the way, have you guys ever heard about the Outlaw Boys? We used to go to Winter Academy Reformatory School in Christmas for Troublemakers, or Warsicht for short, which is a winter version of Sarsicht School. Sarsicht school? school? Um, what is that? 
It is a school that SSJ Mario X05 created back in summer 2021 as a cruel summer boarding school. It became popular in late 2021 to early 2022. However, by late 2022, it became a downfall when Mrs. Carolina Ramirez, who is the principal of Beyond High School, got her reputation severely damaged due to the horrible special video that SSJ Mario made. Still, we didn't care if he apologized to her for his actions against her before we lost our existence. Well, duh. SSJ Mario did an excellent job making this popular 2021 video featuring Lou, Giffany, and that bad influenced guy named Raven. Why would people start to be upset with him all because he made the special video called Sarsic School that nearly destroyed the Viant High School principal's reputation? It reminds me of how much I liked this popular Sarsic video and wanted to be a faculty of a different school similar to Sarsic School, albeit it has now become infamous nowadays according to Trashy Vian Video's wiki. But anyway, have you heard about two other girls who weren't members of your disbanded group and weren't created by CPPF 9000? They were actually made by Death the Hate Master and are the members of the Reapers. One is a girl as the psychotic babe troublemaker, and her name is Amira Storm, who is the maternal niece of the leader of the Reapers. Oh, I see. And what's the other girl called? She is the Amethyst Sorceress Troublemaker and Amira's best friend forever. Her name is Bianca Starr. We also used the Dragon Balls to bring them back to life after getting executed before 2024. Oh, now we remember. We used to watch the Reapers series on YouTube by Death the Hate Master a long time ago. We can't wait to see them in person. Exactly. So, would you do us a favor and hop in my girlfriend's car Cecile and Ariana? Estefania has told me all about the Outlaw Boys and the Reapers. So, therefore, you can see Larry and Jason again. Sure you guys. Let's go. Man, after all the shit we have done in late 2023, this is by far our worst life ever. We still can't believe that Justin, Jesse, Mikey, Kylie, Carson, and Caitlin are gone by getting executed by drowning in the lava. And we may never get to see them again since they're now in hell for good. Justin, Justin Dylan, Dylan Wilson, Wilson Jesse, Jesse Alexander, Alexander Martin, Martin, Mikey James, James Robinson, Robinson, Carson Flynn, Flynn Bradley, Caitlin Kiva Bradley, Bradley, and Kylie Anna Phillips. Do you have any last words before all of you jump into the hole and get drowned in the lava, which is an instant death? No. Please. I don't want to die because I'm too young to do so, so please let me off the hook for real this time. I agree. I do not want to be dead forever. No way. Time's up. Get it and jump into the hole right now. But jump now. You know guys, if only Amira Storm and Bianca Star were still here with us, they would have saved us by bailing us out of jail, just like what Adel Heldus did, and our life wouldn't be like hell as fuck. Agreed. Did somebody say they want to bail us out of jail? Because guess who's back? Wait. You don't mean... Hey there you guys. 
It's been a long time since we saw each other two years ago. Cecile Bernard and I, as Ariana Martinez, have missed you guys so much. Wow. Hey there, Cecile and Ariana. We missed you a lot. You ladies may know us. I'm Aaron Richard Morris. The guy sitting next to me is Larry Lakoff Brooks, and the guy at the top bunk bed is Jason Matei Vasquez. Am I correct? That's right. You guys are correct. The other two ladies created by Death the Hate Master are Amira Storm and Bianca Starr. They're not members of the Cheer Girls but from the Reapers. We met them at the entrance of the prison cell before we came here to bail all of you out of prison with our money. Oh yeah. We've known the other two since last Halloween in 2023. And are you saying we'll escape prison once again, this time by paying? That's right. It is not a joke. You know Aaron, Larry, and Jason, once we bailed you out of jail, we thought we might fall in love with you. Don't you guys want to be our lovers, including boyfriends and fiancés? Does that include dating you, spending time with you, having sex with you, peeking at you using the bathroom, etc? Of course. Everything you want us to do. But if we want, we can use fusion so that all of you men are one, and all of us as women are one. Great idea. Now, do us a favor and unlock the door to bail us out and then we can use bail money to pay so that no one can find out that we escaped jail for real this time. Be my guest. OMG. Thank you ladies so much for bailing us out of jail once again. We appreciate your support. Now, what about the other members of the Outlaw Boys and the Hunts' Kissy Girls? Hiroshi, Lamarcus, Anton, Keenan, Duntrice, Austin, Ainsley, Victoria, and Gabriella must be here somewhere. As for Dylan, Adelheldus, Josephina, and Mirabella, Dylan is still a mild to moderate troublemaker, while Adelheldus, Josephina, and Mirabella all became non-troublemakers. But as for Justin, Jesse, Mikey, Kyle, Carson, and Caitlin, they were executed before you ladies came in. What? what? Aww. Fuck. We never know because we never get to see them in person. Well, it's our best to let things go and move on from them. So, as always, rest in peace to those who are executed and sent to hell instead of heaven. But anyway, we are about to go now since we are starting with our new troublemaking ways. Um, well. Okay. We can start our new, fresh life as a new version of us. Come on you three, let's get you men out of here. Okay. Ah, oh, man. Back at the prison once again. Without Lamarcus, nothing will ever change. Yeah, I know. We remember being sent to prison for the first time for escaping this Christmas school. Winter Academy Reformatory School in Christmas for Troublemakers, or Warsicht for short. And now this for what happened in December 2023. Unbelievable. Someone must save us once again if we want freedom from being imprisoned immediately. Ha! Huh? Who are you? Hey there guys. I'm Freddy Jordan Ortega. I must be the boyfriend of Estefania Garcia. What's your name? Oh. Hey there, Freddy. My name is Keenan Pierre Francois. I'm Anton Sean Roberts. And I'm Demetris O'Shea Young. Why are you here for? I came to save you guys because Estefania has told me all about the Hunces Kissy Girls and the Outlaw Boys like you guys. So I'm here to bail you out because we were hoping you could return to the Outlaw Boys and the Hunces Kissy Girls group. Really? Thanks. We appreciate that. No problem. Now, if you excuse me, I'm going to unlock this prison door so that you guys are free to leave. And the bail payment will be paid ASAP.
OMG, Freddy. You're a lifesaver now that we're free from prison. Thanks a lot once again. It's my pleasure, Keenan. Now, guys, let's get out of here as soon as possible. Right. OMG. We've been suffering from this prison cell, always getting lumpy potatoes, causing us to get stomach cramps. This is the worst day in prison that we've experienced in our life. I know, right, Gab? We got arrested after what happened back in late December 2023. Nothing will happen to us since our lives have already been ruined, as we'll be staying in prison cells for a long time. Exactly. Hey there, Victoria and Gabriella. Are you feeling all right? Oh. Hey, Estefania. We're not okay. Well, yeah, we are a little. It's just that we've been suffering staying in our prison cell for a long time. Are you serious? You women are still in prison? OMG! How do you get there? Well, it's kind of a long story, but we'll tell you once we get out of jail. Anyways, is your boyfriend Ainsley still here with you? Well, actually, I've already broken up with him because my younger sister, Raquel, Gori, and Rafn bailed us out of jail before Ainsley and Austin. I announced my breakup with Ainsley so that I could go back to college, albeit we're still friends at the moment. But after that, I finally found a man that I wanted to have a sexual relationship with, and his name was Freddy Ortega. I told him that he could date me, make out with me, touch me, see me undressed, spend time with me, even fuck me, and I appreciate that. Whoa. I never knew you had a new boyfriend besides Ainsley. Whatever happened to the Austin ex Mirabella, Dylan ex Jasmine? and Larry X. Adelhelda's relationship? All of them have been broken up. You see, just like me, Adelhelda's, short for Adele, has broken up with Larry because she was bailed out of jail before him to return to her everyday life and finish college. After that, she became an alumna of Viand University. Next, Mirabella redeemed herself and apologized to her family for her past actions. She also reprimanded Austin for what he had done to other women and girls, especially Mirabella. And yes, Austin is now single and got kicked out of college for good. Finally, Dylan had enough of Jasmine. He was so upset about his relationship with her because Jasmine was always strict and mean to him. Therefore, he cheated on her by having a relationship with his now girlfriend, whom Austin formerly dated with. Mirabella, the older sister of Anacuta. And to be concluded, Jasmine finally dumped Dylan before falling in love with a black man, David Gustav. So yeah, these are the stories of why the Larry X. Adelheldis, Austin X. Mirabella, and Dylan X. Jasmine relationship ended ultimately. Dang. That sucks. It looks like the Outlaw Boys and the Hunts' Kissy Girls are going downfall to become dead topic troublemaking crews. Am I correct? Yeah, you are correct. Like fucking seriously? Jasmine and I are the only female crew left. And to make matters even worse, six members, Justin, Jesse, Kylie, Mikey, Carson, and Caitlin, have died due to being drowned in the lava as their execution. What? They're executed for real. No way! This means we'll never get to see them again without saying goodbyes to them. Yeah, that's what normally happened. Everyone dies at some point, you know that? Yeah. yeah. But look ladies, we have new members from the Cheer Girls and the Reapers. Two of them are Cecile Bernard and Ariana Martinez, and the other two are Amira Storm and Bianca Starr. So if I unlock the door to bail both of you out of jail, I'll be paying for it so that police will let us off the hook for real this time. Really? You can do that? Of course you silly bitch. Let me unlock the door for you too. 
Just hold on. Wow, Estefania. Thank you very much for saving us. You really know how much we kind of love you to begin with. Our lives have been saved because of you. I agree. Now is it our time to depart from this crappy prison? Absolutely, Gab. Now girls, let's go find the rest of the crew immediately before something happens to us. Okay. okay. All right, thanks for making the bail payment. Wait for your friends to show up after being in a prison cell for nearly a long time, then you guys are free to go. Hey there, guys. Welcome back once again. Since we made a bail payment for all of you, it's time to leave this police station. So, let's go right now. You know guys, I think I'm sensing LaMarcus's track. He could be anywhere if he's still alive. Two years ago, he and I were the original members of the Outlaw Boys. We used to go to Warsic School in December 2022, which stands for Winter Academy Reformatory School in Christmas for Troublemakers. Nevertheless, he might never have the same appearance as he had before, but at least he still has his troublemaking personality. Follow me. Right. Hey guys, over here. Hey there. What's your name? You look like LaMarcus Parker to us. I'm Lamar BHH and Ishan Cooper HH. The fusion of LaMarcus Keyshawn Parker and some users from SSJ Mario doesn't want to mention. Also, Rainbow Lane and Seven and I found this hideout so that whenever the authority tries to catch us, we will always escape to this hideout where I'm at right now. You guys must be Hiroshi, Austin, and Ainsley. Am I correct? We certainly are. I believe that this hideout will be an ideal location to ensure that nobody, particularly the authorities, will discover our whereabouts. You are correct. Also, Rainbow Lane and Seven is still in the building, so I left the door unlocked for you guys to enter this hideout. You guys are free to come in. Okay. okay. Excuse me, Rainbow Lane and, and Lou Marby. Yes? Since you, too, fused with other characters, can we also do a fusion too? Okay, okay. We will demonstrate to you guys how to use a fusion technique. But it will only be two people at a time. So we used Vi and Logic to summon a Patara earring, and once all of you joined in, you will all be forever stuck in that form for good. But anyways, let's start with the fusion dance. First, have your hand raised to start with a fusion dance. Second, say the word, few, before you do the ballet dance doing tippy toes. Few. After that, you point your hands away from your partner by oppositely pointing them after saying the word, John. And finally, Grab your hands with your partner and touch each other's hands to complete the fusion dance before saying the word, ha, and kaboom. You have completed the fusion dance, and you will hear a sound that is the opening of fusion. So do you guys understand the fusion dance we demonstrated? Yes! yes.
Well actually, for me, I decided to sit this one out during the fusion dance. I want to do a fusion dance, and I want to be the most strongest Japanese troublemaking fusee in Vian City. Well, you know what? Since I'm a guy who was born in the UK but raised in Japan, and I'm a single person who used to have a girlfriend in the past, I'll fuse with Hiroshi. Good. It looks like we're ready to go. The fusion of Hiroshi and Austin. Come on, Hiroshi and Austin. Stand next to the big screen to show us your new appearance as fusees. Sure. sure. All right, Hiroshi and Austin, you know the demonstration of the fusion dance, right? Right. right. Good. Now, ready, set, go! Few. Zan. Ha! Whoa. I have never seen this fused person before. I am neither Austin nor Hiroshi. I am Ostroshi. The guy who is now born. Welcome Ostroshi to the world of Viand as a fusee. This means that you two are one. What? We are one? That's right. Welcome aboard Ostroshi. Now if the fusion dance has already been used, the Potera fusion will be the only fusion that should be used for now. So what do you say Ainsley? You don't have an interesting characteristic appearance to continue through your whole life. So come and get the Potera earrings to fuse with him. Well Lumarbi, I think I can do that since I want my life to continue running no matter what. So I'll do a Potera fusion with Ostroshi. Well, it looks like someone is joining the Fusion Club today now. All right. It looks like we're ready to do this part for sure. Whenever you ready, Ostroshi and Ainsley, put your earrings right now. Hello. There. Guys. You did it! You fused, meaning that you three are one. Congratulations, and welcome to the Fusion Club! Uh, thanks. Now tell us, what would you like to name yourselves in full name? Well, you see, since Hiroshi Kai Nakajima, Austin Kata Yamamoto Harris, and Ainsley Robbie Reed have fused together as one like us, this makes me then. I am Ostrishly Kate B. Yakajade. Welcome abroad to this upcoming group, Ostrishly. We're so glad that it is your first time being a fused troublemaker. Now, while we're calling the remainder of the outlaw boys and the Hunts' kissy girls to come to his hideout that we adopted, you can stay here, chill, and wait right here. Right? Yes, I understand. That's good. And if something happens to them, this troublemaking experience will end like this. You take care of yourselves when we come back. I will you guys. Well, 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 what have we here now? If it isn't Lou and Giffany again. Or should we say, Chris the UK douchebag, and Melinda the Japanese bitch. This is our revenge for constantly losing against you too. That bitch with pink hair and her boyfriend probably had a bad influence relationship, which led to their decision to break up and avoid getting married in the future. So, yeah, we can all agree that their parents are right all along. As for you Lou and Gif, I hope both of you will suffer the same treatment from us as I did back in 2022 and 2023. 
ha ha ha, lol. They need to learn not to spend time to date with each other and act up like they are staying single forever. What a fucking pervert Lou is, and what a whore Giffany is. No! Guys, please inform Louisiana and I that we didn't do anything wrong and that it's not a big deal at all. Why do you feel the need to bully people like us? You guys better stay away from us and put the gun and the knife down. And don't talk trash to us like I'm a perverted asshole and Giffany is a slutty bitch. We're not single at this time, and I want to marry Jif because she is the hottest womanly sweetie babe that I have ever spent time with. So please do us a fucking favor and beat it right now. No goddamn it. We are not beating it until you guys are single. Otherwise, we have no choice but to make you suffer. Now how about both of you begin to end the relationship and move forward with your lives, just as your parents would prefer for you not to be romantically involved at your age? Yeah, come on, do us a favor already. Well, what are you waiting for? If you don't, then get lost then. <laughs> Wait, Melinda, I'm here for you. Good. Good day to you as you explore a different park or chat with your parents about the park's activities. We hope both of you understand our message clearly. OMG. Lou is running after Giffany, who cries like a slutty bitch longing for her parents. Hey there you guys. Hey there you too. How are you all doing? Bianca, we are doing well. We can see that it doesn't count that you guys missed some shit that were giving Lou and Giffany a threatening taste of their own medicine, so therefore, you all came along. Is this true? Yes, it is true. We never missed this, and we got David to record it on video and upload it on YouTube. Wow! Really? Now we can see the video of Lou and Giffany suffering from our bullying. Thanks a lot, David! No problem, Bianca. Now everyone, please get on your phone and go to YouTube to see my channel so you can see the video I uploaded today. Alright. Be our guest. Hello there, you guys. Oh, uh, hi? Oh my god. Who the fuck are you guys? Yeah, you better tell us who you are exactly. I am Rainbow Lane and Reggie Ruprints, aka Rainbow Lane and Seven. The fusion of Volan and Rup and Rainboy 107. And I'm Limmerby HH and Ishan Cooker HH, the fusion of Lamarcus Keyshawn Parker, Robbie Animator Cooper, and HHHH Gonamate. And we wanted to ask you guys if you can be part of our group. A group? Why should we join you? The reason for that is because SSJ Mario finds both of you pretty and hot on the outside, but icky and evil on the inside. And what about me? You're just a cool skeleton dude who is also a cruel troublemaker as well. Also, Jordy Toon Z Station did an excellent job with his Grounded series, making SSJ Mario X05 more entertaining than before. Well, I guess that explains the truth. Who are you guys exactly? I'm Josiah Dead One. My name is Dora Anastasia Marquez, aka Dora the Explorer. And I'm Jessica Alyssa Sliders. But we don't want to join you guys because nobody in the Vyond world likes us. Are you not okay? You seem to be in a bad mood today. No. It is because my ex-boyfriend Abhinav treated me like I was a goddess to him, and he also featured me a lot in his videos. And now, nobody likes me because I have no personality whatsoever. Therefore, I am now a bland character as of now. Nonsense. Jessica, you're not excessively bland, and there's no need to worry about presenting yourself in a provocative manner. The same applies to you, Dora. And both of you can be treated like porn stars, a goddesses, and hot girls because we are here for you. You know what girls, and you Josiah? 
We're just going to give you personalities and new appearances if three of you use fusion dance and parafusion with another crew member together. Really? Then everybody must show us that we're hot, sexy, and pretty on the outside but icky, mean, and vile on the inside. Agreed with Dora. You know what? We'll take it as a yes. Good. Now come on. Man. I was going to use my phone to record a video of Melinda running off crying to look after her parents while Christopher was trying to go after her, but David recorded a whole video for us. Yeah, I know. You should thank my boyfriend for the memorization he brings us to. Exactly. Speaking of him, he's in another van with Gabriella, Victoria, Anton, Keenan, and Dime Trice. I hope they'll be safe to go through the hideout like we will. Oh, they'll be safe all right. Um, hey, Larry. What happened to the name Outlaw Boys and Hunts' Kissy Girls? Just so you know, Amira. A couple of days ago, Rainbow Lane and Seven, Lamarby, Aaron, and I came up with a new name that combines the Outlaw Boys and the Hunts' Kissy Girls. And what could it be? It's called, The Immoral Devil. Whoa, cool. Like that name. Did Rainbow Lane and Seven send you a GPS showing where our new hideout is? He did indeed. Additionally, Amira, please refrain from disclosing this information, particularly if you have confidants who have sadistic tendencies. No need to worry, Larry. I won't. We'll not only be lovers, but also boyfriend and girlfriend, meaning a couple, and we will be engaged to become husband and wife. So, are you with me? As long as Aaron, Jason, and I are fused together as one, and you, your bestie Bianca, Cecile, and Ariana are fused together as one, then yes. I'm here for you. The immoral devil will begin and continue to grow with the competition of the poisonous demons and the Alanastuums. All right, Amira, let's go. Hmm. Well, I'm pretty sure that this fusion version of Troublemakers would be better, but evil than we were before. Oh, don't worry, dude. You'll get yours next soon. Uh, yeah, well, whatever. Okay, Jessica and Dora. Are you ready for the fusion dance to change your new appearance for both of you as one? We, we sure are. All right, now start raising your hands after I say, set. Okay? Here we go. Ready? Set? Go! Few. John. Ha. Ugh, where am I? Wow. I am neither Jessica or Dora, I am Jasira. That means I am they. We are one. Hey, you guys. What do you think of my new appearance? Hey there, Jessira. We can say that your new appearance looks great on you. Thanks a lot. No problem. Now, if you want your fusion to be permanent, you have to wait for the other immoral members to arrive so that they will want to do a fusion dance too. Yes, I understand. All right, you guys. Now that you Ostrosley, Jasira, and Josiah are here, we'll wait for the rest of the immoral devil members to get to the hideout immediately. I'm pretty sure that they'll be safe without getting caught by an authority or killed. Yeah, agreed with Lamabi. So please remain seated while we wait for the others to come as soon as possible.
What's this we see? It seems that our new group is attracting a lot of troublemakers. The immoral devil, created from the outlaw boys and the Hunts' kissy girls. All we need now is the immoral devil poster after some of you performed the fusion dance in Pod Era Fusion. And yes, Larry, Rainbow Linen, and I purchased an external lock from a store like Walmart. Is that right? Exactly, Lamarby. We are all going to fuse together so that we can begin with our introduction to the immoral devil. No one will ever stop us because a fused person is way more stronger than a normal person, despite the fact that there are unfused members in the group. It is because they care about their families, raising them to become who they are. Right Larry and Amira. Also, we have a secret door to open to get into a secret hideout room. Suppose any of you have any instruments like firearms, blades, and sharpening utensils to be used as weapons, money that is from a bank that we robbed, and or gambling that we played. In that case, we can use a cover box to hide everything we have so that no one but us can futurely see and use it. Agreed, but not today, because it is necessary for us to have a van or an automobile. And what else? Suppose we steal vehicles like taxes, cars, vans, or buses. Does it have to be feature kidnapping people if they're too stupid to see us and recognize our actions like sleeping, fainting, and giving them concussions before bringing them to our hideout? Nope. We're not trying to be mean to you, but not only people, but also the police are smart enough to start the realization that we're in a hideout that we spotted and lived in if we attempt to do so. But it is excellent and revengeful to find someplace other than our hideout, like a sewer, a den, an old abandoned house, etc. Oh. Right. Sorry about that. We can agree that this is the most terrible idea to lure a kidnapping victim into our hideouts. But I think sending them into either a sewer or an abandoned house would be better. But anyway, can we start a fusion already? It feels like Amira, Cecile, Ariana, and I are about to fall in love and start a sexual relationship with Larry, Aaron, and Jason. Well, okay then. We can start a fusion right now. But before we do so, let us demonstrate how to do a fusion dance before moving on to a Patara fusion. Okay, now we think we're ready to use a fusion technique. Aaron and I will be the first ones to do the fusion dance. And I will fuse with Aaron and Larry using a Patara earring to do a Patara fusion after they both fuse together. Okay, you Aaron and Larry will do a fusion dance, and during your fusion appearance, both of you as one and Jason will do a Patara fusion to become one. So Aaron and Larry, don't just sit here. Come to the big screen to show us your new appearance as fusees. Sure. sure. Okay, Aaron and Larry, ready for yourselves to fuse together to become one? We, we sure are. Good. Now, ready, set, go! Fuse. Fuse. Zon. Ha! I am neither Aaron nor Larry. I'm Ari. Therefore, this makes us as one. What's up guys? What are your thoughts about us as one? Hello there Ari. Your fusion makes both of you as one look handsome today. Appreciate that. Now Jason, ready to do a Potara fusion with me? Why do you say Jason? Are you gonna fuse with him or not? Sure. I'll fuse with him if I want my antagonistic troublemaking career to grow on. Let's get this Patara fusion started. Okay, Ari and Jason. Whenever you guys are ready, you can put on some earrings now to begin your Patara fusion process.
da. Hello there, motherfuckers. Nice work. With you guys as Aaron, Larry, and Jason fused together, all of you are officially one person. Congrats on making it to a fusion club. Thanks a lot, you guys. Don't forget to tell us your full fusion name. I'm the fusion of Aaron Richard Morris, Larry Lakoff Brooks, and Jason Matei Vasquez. I am Jaseri Ricodii Brascaris. Hello there, Jaseri. We're so excited that you being a fused multiracial person as a troublemaker for the first time. I know. I'm very glad that I'm going to be the most strongest and evilest troublemaker in the world of Viant. Now, who's up next to do the fusion technique? It's our turn. Me and Bianca will do a fusion dance one, Cecile and Ariana will do a fusion dance two, and we'll use Patera fusion to become as one. So I want to go next. Same here. Same here two. And same here three. Okay. Jaseri will take over since he's a leader of the Immoral Devil. So I'm just going to sit down and enjoy the fusion show. You heard what Lamarbi said. Come on Amira and Bianca, get onto the big screen to begin with a fusion dance. Okay. Alright Amira and Bianca, you know the demonstration of the fusion dance, right? Right Jaseri. I understand the demonstration of the fusion dance. Me too. Awesome. Now raise your hands when I say set to begin the fusion dance. Okay? Here we go. Ready? Set? Go. Few. Zon. Ha! Whoa. I look different now. I am amazed. That I feel... Incredible! I, as Amira and Bianca had joined our bodies together, so that makes us as one like me. Therefore, I am Ami Inca. Hey there Ami Inca. Another female fusion person is joining in today, huh? Mm hmm. That's right. Now I'm gonna let someone else do a fusion dance next. And that is Ariana and Cecile. That's us next. We can't wait to do a Patara fusion next after we fuse together to become one. Also, since Patara fusion is going to be permanent, I have decided that I won't need glasses anymore. There, now I'm ready to go. And the Marby. Please break my glasses for me before putting them in the trash can. Can you do that? Of course, Ariana. Wearing glasses won't be worth your time anymore. So give me your glasses, and I'll do it right now. Okay. It looks like another one will do a female fusion dance today, huh? Okay, Cecile and Ariana, get onto the big screen to start your fusion technique immediately. Okay. All right, you know the fusion dance. Are you ready, ladies? Yes, we are. Good. Now. Ready, set, go. Few. John. Ha. Boof. Where am I? Ha. Huh. I looked new on me. Yes, you are exactly. You're in the land of Viand as a fusee, meaning that you two are one as well. Ha! Huh. Rainbow Lane and Seven is right. Whoever you are has been fused together. Can you tell us your fusion name before proceeding to the Potera fusion? Well, 
I'm... Cecile and Ariana have been fused together, which makes us one, and myself as they are. I am Ceciliana. Hey there Ceciliana. Since I think that we're good to go, you and Emyinka will be able to fuse together to become one by using the Potara fusion. So what do you want to say to me? Are you in with me? We can have so much fun being so horny and dateable with Jaceri and cause chaos throughout Vian City whenever we want. Okay, Ami Inka, I will fuse with you. It's a deal then, so let's do this shit already. Okay. All right, Ami Inka and Ceciliana. Now is your chance to put on some earrings and start your life as a holy fused person. You are free to do so right now. Whoa! What is this? Yes! I am now they, we are one! I'm finally a fused woman! Wow madam! Congrats! You made it to the fusion club already! Jayzuri and I are proud of you! Thank you! It's no problem! So, anyway, would you be a co-leader of the immoral devil and my lover, including my girlfriend and my fiancé, meaning that you will marry me? Rare. Yes. I will be your lover and a co-leader of the immoral devil. Great. Now, tell us your full fusion name. Okay. So as you can see, Amira Storm, Bianca Starr, Cecile Bernard, and Ariana Martinez had fused together to become all of us as one, and this is what I was born. My name is Ami Inciliana Starnanez. Why hello there, Ami Inciliana, or should I say, my new hot baby girlfriend. Once we marry, you and I will be together forever, and we will never give up on our crimes. <laughs> You're not wrong, Jaceri. I couldn't have said it better myself. Now everyone, who else wants to do the fusion dance and or pot era fusion next? I want to go next. I'm ready to do fusion since I'm satisfied with this technique. The same goes for me. I will fuse with Gabriella, and we will become who we are. Great plan you ladies as well. Let's give Amy and Siliana the opportunity to contribute, as she is Jayzuri's girlfriend and the immoral devil's second-in-command. As Lamabi mentioned, I'll simply relax and enjoy the fusion show. So it'll be just Amina and I. Come on Victoria and Gabriella, come onto the big screen to begin your fusion dance. Okay. Ready to raise your hands to start your fusion dance ladies? We're ready. Good. And now, ready, set, go. Few. Zon. Ha. Whoa. I look different now. I am not exactly Victoria or Gabriella anymore. I am Victoriella. This means we are reunited as one person. I look great now. So, do you think I look so pretty, beautiful, and cute on the outside? If not, then that's okay by me. You know Victoriella, we can say yes, that your appearance looks pretty, cute, and beautiful on the outside. And to make yourself look prettier, do you want to add lips on you? Which color do you like on them? Well, since I like deep ocean blue and milky pink, I want my lipstick to be a mixture of these colors. That would be the best choice for me. <laughs> okay, then. Follow me to add your color mixture to your own lipstick. Okay. 
Let's go. So, Victoriella, how do you like your lips worn by yourself as a fusy? It looks pretty on me. And with this lipstick, I'll be so pretty wearing it all the time, even during sleep, shower, etc. Does anyone want to fuse with me so we can become one for real now? Um, no. I can't do that, because, first of all, I want to keep my body since my parents would kill me if I was stuck in that fusion form forever, and second of all, I am fine with being a diffused person. Yeah, I agree with Jasmine. I don't want to do this because my mother and my younger siblings would be so apoplectic if they saw me like this as I fused with another person. Well, excuse me. I want to fuse with you, Victoriella. Call me Jasira since Jessica Sliders and Dora Marquez are from Oven of Aravind and Jordi Toon Z Station respectively. We have used fusion dance together to become one. So would you be okay if we could join bodies with you? You and I want to be super hot and sexy if we fuse together. So pick me now. Okay, Jasira. You and Victoriella are gonna use Potter of Fusion to join bodies together. Is that correct? Yes! Then come to the big screen so we can get started with the Potara fusion process. Whenever you're ready fused ladies, put on some earrings to let your bodies drag into another one and create your new appearance. Hey, you guys. Wow. Congratulations, girlfriend. You are officially a member of the Fusion Club. Really? Aw, oh, thank you. Now I look even more prettier and hotter than I was before. It's no problem, ma'am. What Fusion name would you like to name yourself? Well, since Jessica Alyssa Sliders, Dora Anastasia Marquez, Victoria Keisha Lopez, and Gabriella Pinky Evans had all been fused together to become one as me. I go by my name, Jessica Ariella Pinla Anastasia Lovacaz. Hi, Jessica Ariella. We can't believe that you and I are the only fused people as troublemaking ladies. That's right. We're the one and only women of fusees left. All right, guys, who wants to do fusion next after me? Um, I decided to pass and sit this one out because I just want to be myself as a normal human. I agreed with Freddie. Not only would our girlfriends Jasmine and Estefania not be pleased about this if we fused together, but my sister, my relatives, and my parents would kill me as well. So, I'm not doing it. I want to do a fusion dance because I'm in love with Jessica Oriella. Same here. I can't wait to spend time with, make out with, and have sex with that fused lady. So I'll fuse with Keenan. Since that lady is going hot on me, I think I'll do a fusion dance too. Since I want to show my compassion and love to the fused lady, I guess I'll fuse with Anton for good. We want to be her lover, boyfriend, and even fiancé. Aw, you have a crush on me? Thanks! I'm so sexually romantic that I could kiss you if all of you looked handsome in your completed fusion form. Okay, okay, so Keenan and Dime Trice, both of you will do a fusion dance. Then, it's Anton and Josiah Dead One's turn to do a fusion next. And finally, both of you will a Potara fusion to become one person. Now come here to the big screen to get this fusion dance process started. Okay! okay. Okay guys, are you ready for your fusion dance to change your new appearance? Yes, yes we, we are. are! Good then. Now let's begin. Ready, set, go! Phew! Sean! Ah! ah.
Um, where am I? Whoa. We were combined together to become one person like me. Keenan plus Dine Trice makes. Keymetris. What's up, Keymetris? What do you feel in your fusion form? I look amazing, thanks to me. And now, Anton and Josiah, you're up next for the fusion dance. Are you gonna go to the big screen, or not? Keymetra says you're next in line. Yeah, of course. I wanna come fuse with Josiah. And then I'll want to get a sexual attraction with this fused lady, Jessa Ariella. This is going to be epic. Agreed! Even though I am a humanoid skeleton that wants to fuse with other men who are African Americans, I want to try the fusion as well. So let's go right now. All right, guys, both of you will be the last person to do a fusion dance together to become one, so are you ready now? Yes, yes we, we are. are. Okay, then, for the final time, here we go. Ready? Set? Go. Phew. Sean. Ha. I am neither Anton nor Josiah. Call me Antoncia, a skeletal African-American fused person who seeks out for antagonism. Well, hey, they're Antoncia. Not only are both of you one, but you're right. You are a fused man due to the black skin color of African-Americans and a skeleton in humanoid form. So now that we're all done with the fusion dance, will you fuse with me with the Potara fusion by wearing earrings to join bodies to become one? We are going to be so much handsome on the outside, but evil and cruel on the inside because we'll not only will date, spend time with, and have sex with Jessa Oriella, but also cause trouble around Vian City for good. Well, of course, Keymetris. I'll fuse with you if you insist. All right, everything sorted out. You, Anton Saya, and Keymetris will use earrings to initiate your Potara fusion and merge into one being. So, for the final time, let's begin the Potara fusion already. Right. Remember the drill, Keymetris and Antonsia. Put on some earrings to start your Potara fusion whenever you're ready to begin your life as a fused person. Huh? I have finally fused into a skeletal African-American person. Whoa, man. Congratulations. You have finally merged, and now you are all one. Welcome to the Fusion Club. Thanks a lot. I think I look handsome now, so I get to live with Jess Ariella, meaning I want to marry her someday. No problem, dude. Now let us know your fusion name before you can hang out with Jessa Ariella while I hang out with Emmy and Siliana. Okay. So, Anton Sean Roberts, plus Josiah Dead One, plus Keenan Pierre Francois, plus Dime Trice Oshiam. This equals to Anton Symmetris, which is my real fusion name. Call me Anton Symmetris, Pierre Hand Robansiam. Hello there, Anton Symmetris. That is the longest name you got there. Let's use the shortest name. So, Jesseri can be called Jerry, I can be called Amira, Amiriana Amira, or Miriana, Jessa Oriella can be called Jesse, Vicky, Tori, or Jessica, and you can be called Antoncia or Anton. Do I make myself clear? Yes, we can handle that short fusion name. Good then. 
Now go find Jessera Riella if you like before we can start the introduction to the members of the Immoral Devil. Right then. Alright guys, now that we're all done with the fusion dance and Potara fusion process. It's time for the introduction to who we are as the Immoral Devil. I'm Jesseri Ricodii Brascaris, the leader of the Immoral Devil. And I'm Amy and Siliana Starnanez. And I'm the second in command of the Immoral Devil and Jesseri's boyfriend and fiancé. Since I don't have a middle name, I guess I can create my own. Rosalina. I go by my name, Amy and Siliana Rosalina Starnanez. Alright, now what about you guys? Tell us your name and your background. I'm Rainbow Lane and Reggie Ruprins, but you can call me Rainbow Lane and Seven, Rainboy, or Rainbow Lane. And. I'm the fusion of Volan and Rup and Rainboy 107. I'm Lamar BHH Anishan Cooker HH. I'm the fusion of Lamarcus Keyshawn Parker, Robbie Animator Cooper, and HHHH Go Animate. I'm Jessica Ariella Pinlin Astasia Lovacaz. I'm one of the Latina members of the Immoral Devil and Anton Metris girlfriend and fiancé. I'm the fusion of Victoria Keisha Lopez, Gabriela Pinky Evans, Jessica Alyssa Sliders, and Dora Anastasia Marquez. I'm Anton Metris, Pierre Hand, Robonsiam. I'm one of the African-American members of the Immoral Devil and Jessica Ariella's boyfriend and fiancé. I'm the fusion of Anton Sean Roberts, Josiah Dead One, Keenan Pierre Francois, and Dime Trice Oshiyam. I'm Ostrishly Kate B. Yakajid. I'm the fusion of Hiroshi Kai Nakajima, Austin Kata Yamamoto Harris, and Ainsley Ruby Reed. I'm Estefania Martina Garcia. I was born in the USA and raised there, but I was raised in Mexico, so I'm a white Latina member of the Immoral Devil. My name is Freddy Jordan Ortega. I was born and raised in the USA but moved to Cuba as a teenager. I'm a college dropout who is also a member of the Immoral Devil. I'm Jasmine Sisko Naminen. I came from Finland, where I was born. I am a Scandinavian female member of the Immoral Devil. And I'm David Jr. Gustav. I was born in the USA and am an African-American man of Haitian and South African descent. I am a black member of the Immoral Devil. All right, hey there you guys. Welcome to the newest evil and vile troublemaking group, the Immoral Devil. Hey there! It's great to observe and encounter all of you folks. Apart from that, we will encounter additional individuals who are unkind, malicious, and unpleasant, just like the rest of us. Um, hello? Jaseri? I have a question for you. Are you going to make some rules sooner? Yes, Lamarby. I might do it later real soon. You know what, my handsome boyfriend? If we use something to spray graffiti on the wall, we can do this for real this time. Sure, Emmy and Siliana, my sweetie babe. We'll do this for sure. But anyway, let's continue where I left off. If any nine of you have a family with you, this hideout is the place where you will not be living. Therefore, you will live with your parents, relatives, and or siblings. So Estefania, Freddy, Jasmine, and David, you all are free to go. As for you, Anton Metris and Jessica Ariella, since both of you are a couple, you both will be living with my girlfriend and I in Immoral's first big hideout. You three, Rainbow Lane and Seven, Lamarby HH, and Ostrashley, will be roommates in Immoral's second big hideout. Because I bought two wedding rings that I must place on Amira's wedding finger, and you, Antonsia, will place them on Jesse's finger too. We will elope so that we'll all become husband and wife and sign in so that you, Antonsia, Jesse, my girlfriend, and I will all be foster siblings. Later tonight, we plan to visit the car dealership and take the most luxurious and expensive car without setting off any alarms. Who's in? I want to come to pick a secondary luxurious car. Same here. Same here too. I'll come but I'll go with the primary luxurious car that you'll choose. I'm with my boyfriend, so me too. All right, perfect. Now, come see us at the auto dealership at approximately midnight. 
Okay, I have a slingshot with me if any of these security cameras would have an opportunity to catch us stealing luxurious cars. Rainbow Lanin, that's an excellent choice you got there. Now what are we waiting for guys? Let's go immediately. Okay. okay. Emmy and Celiana, I just want to say that I'll always love you, even though you don't have any parents since they're in prison forever. You'll be my forever girlfriend, and you'll be my wife as well. We're not going to have kids, though, until it is the right time to do so. We'll do anything X-rated and toilet humor related, but we'll also go on many dates. So, Amira, will you marry me? Aww. Of course, Jaseri. I want to marry you. We're going to have so much fun causing trouble around Vian City. So, yeah, I'll marry you. So, Jessera Riella, since Jesseri has two wedding rings, would you like to marry me since you look so attractive and I look so manly to each other? We'll have fun causing a lot of trouble here in Vian City as well. Ha 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 ha. Yes, Anton Siometris. I'll let you have my virginity forever. Oh, and what about the relationship between Jaseri and Ami and Celiana and us? Who are we exactly? Oh, he's going to sign us up to become pseudo-siblings. So that means I will be Jaseri and Amira's pseudo-brother, and you'll be Jaseri and Amira's pseudo-sister. Exactly. And Jaseri will be our pseudo-brother, and Amira will be our pseudo-sister. Am I correct? Yes, you guys are correct. I thought you guys would be foster siblings, but oh well, it is pseudo-siblings? My mistakes. No worries, bro. You're good. We can't wait until this day arrives for this thing to happen to us. For our wedding to occur in the future? Ha ha ha. Yes, handsome. This creates us as four members, as a new troublemaking family. A moral devil. Yup. This will be our new family from now on. We have decided to take cars from the car dealership without triggering an alarm when nobody is inside because the employees have gone home to rest. Wait a minute. What about the car plate? Law enforcement will discover and acknowledge that we've taken two brand new vehicles consecutively. Ah shit. Jaseri and I will replace Vian County's car plate with our own one for tomorrow. I am grateful because you remember the lookout for that, man. Um, you welcome then? Anyway, it's getting late right now. So why don't we just go to bed and wake up at around 7am? Good then. We no longer have to deal with our parents since we claimed this spot as our home. I know. But let's go to our own room to sleep since we don't want to stay up too late to have insomnia. Okay. okay. Hey, Jaseri? What, Amira? Aren't we, Antonsia and Jesse, supposed to marry on the same day so that we can create our new family? I missed my parents so much since I never got to see them again. It's okay, babe. The family of yours will never die. You and I will be together forever once we are married, remember? I had my parents with me, but I got sent to an orphanage when they were all dead before I became a fused person. 
That's why I chose you to give our love to each other. We'll have sex without having a baby by using condoms, remember? Um, okay. But aren't we going to deal with that pink-haired bitch named Melinda, who professionally goes by the name, Giffany, along with her so-called lover from the ugly doll movie named Lou Perfection, and her other friends from the group called the Rainbow Maples? Aha. Uh -huh. They have no chance against us in our fusion form. So this will be our only chance to make our troublemaking things right in a vengeful way. Ha ha ha. Good. I can't wait to see their faces again when they see us in person again, this time in a permanent fusion form. Right. Because it is already late, would you like to share a kiss with me before we head to sleep? Sure, handsome. Let's kiss. I love you so much, a lot more. I love you too more, to the moon and back. Let's go to sleep right now. Okay.